Hey guys, my Birchbox has finally arrived. This is gonna be my unboxing for Birchbox November, and it arrived on the 19th, which is a little bit later than normal. I've already seen several of my friends' unboxings, and when my box comes later than everyone else's, I tend to think that there's gonna be different samples in here than what I've already seen. So I'm really curious to see if my theory is correct. <laughs> Let's open it up and see what we got. This month's theme is more good, and they're letting us know that the Birchbox shop is donating a portion of their proceeds to No Kid Hungry. That's a nationwide organization that works to end childhood hunger. That's definitely worth mentioning. So if you make a purchase this month, um, they'll give something back. I love that. And on the back of the card are my products. Looks like there are five things in there plus an extra, and I'll list all of this out in the down bar for you guys. And we've also got a little booklet here. So it says you're invited, Birchbox Holiday 2013. And this has all of their gift giving ideas. So if you've been on their website, they have different categories like under 25, hostess gifts, subscription boxes, and that's what's in here. It's basically the physical form of their website, which is pretty cool. I'm gonna look at that later. So here is my box and it does feel pretty light, but it looks full. The first thing I'm going to take out is this packet. This is from Mox Botanicals. It's bath milk in coconut and vanilla bean. There's a little packet inside that looks like a tea bag. This is a coconut and vanilla bean infused soak with sea salt inside. And the instructions say you can just drop this tea bag in and let it steep in the tub, or you can rip it open and directly disperse it into the water. Normally, I'm not a bath person, but with something that smells this good, with nice soft scent of vanilla and beneficial sea salt, I certainly can make an exception. The next thing in my box, I'm pretty sure everybody got this. Um, this is the Chella Ivory Lace Highlighter, and it is supposed to be a 10-in-1 multifunctional pencil. You can highlight, brighten, and contour with it. And the color is pretty light, so you can see there's a swatch on my hand and it blends out really nicely. If you start to just kind of rub it, you can see that even though I have like quite a bit of lines on the back of my hand, it's not settling. It's very creamy and natural looking. This looks awesome on my skin tone, so I'm pretty excited about using that. I don't normally have a lot of um, darkness under my eyes or anything like that, but as far as like a highlight and a contour under my brow area or even along the bridge of my nose, I would use that for those purposes. The next thing in here is the little birch box packet and we've got two samples inside. The first one is nail polish. This is from Color Club and this is in the color Dark and Stormy. I've noticed more and more Birchbox is sending us Color Club samples and you guys know I love nail polish samples but I'm gonna be honest and tell you guys I miss when we used to get Zoya. I just I love Zoya in general but I mean nail polish is good so I'm happy with the nail polish and I've been really into these kind of dark colors. If you guys just watched my sweater weather tag I was just talking about gray kind of granite colors and this one has almost like a little bluish throw to it. It's pretty cool. So when I paint my nails with that, I'll put a swatch up on my Instagram. So make sure you guys are following me on there. The other sample that was in here is the Viva La Juicy Noir. This is their new scent. And this is supposed to be a more sultry take on the fragrance with notes of berry and honeysuckle. I have to see what this smells like. I like that better than Viva La Juicy. I don't really like Viva La Juicy actually. I like these kind of variations they do. This one's good. I think I have to buy this. Mmm, I like that a lot. It's um, sultry without being very overpowering, but like I like things with that little bit of berry infusion in them, like blackberries and things. I like that. That's good. The next thing I have in here is a trio of samples. It's like a three-step skincare regimen. So this is from Derma E, and there is a cleanser, a serum, and a moisturizer there. These are supposed to be anti-aging, and looks like there's a lot of natural ingredients in there. I'm seeing vitamin A, C, and E, olive oil, chamomile, lemongrass, uh, just to name a few. So um, something like this is kind of handy for traveling. I can make this work, so I always like skincare samples anyway. The last thing in the box is the Birchbox Extra, which is ah, the Ghirardelli Chocolate Bar. And I'm so happy I got Toffee Crunch because that is my favorite. I love toffee. And these are new, I guess it is. So yeah, rich milk chocolate. 
absolutely amazing. This is going in my purse and I'm going to eat this immediately. <laughs> but uh, yeah, I love when Birchbox sends me chocolate. So yay for that. That was everything in the box. And overall, I'm going to give it two thumbs up. I was happy with what I got. The chocolate bar is full size. I got a really good smelling perfume and the cello, which let me know if you guys got that too, because I really feel like everybody got that in their box. I love getting nail polish too. So yeah, I have no complaints about this. Uh, even with the skincare thing, it's three steps. So yeah, I'm a happy camper this month and I thought it was awesome. I'm definitely going to be visiting the Birchbox shop because I have a lot of points saved up. And I did want to mention that. Make sure you guys are leaving the reviews on your products that come in your box because you get free points and the points equal money. I'm actually going to be placing an order today and it's not going to cost me a penny because of all my Birchbox points. So make sure you guys are doing that because it's really beneficial for you. Um, let me know what was inside of your box or what you thought about mine. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you again soon with a new video. Bye!